Terry Silver seems to have been thoroughly dealt with going into Cobra Kai Season 6. The villain, who first appeared in The Karate Kid Part 3 in 1989, made a return to the valley in Season 4 and only became an even more significant threat in Season 5. His wealth and cruelty made it seem as if there would be no beating him, and it looked for a time that Silver would be the primary villain for the remainder of Cobra Kai. However, the combined efforts of Miyagi-Do and Eagle Fang Karate saw Terry Silver come to justice, but is he really gone for good? At the end of Cobra Kai Season 5, the interdojo drama came to a head, and Johnny Lawrence, Chozen Taguchi, and Mike Barnes headed to Terry Silver's house to deal with the villain once and for all. In the meantime, the students of Miyagi-Do and Eagle Fong came together to prove to the world that Silver was a cheat, uploading a video of the man committing assault and bribery to the internet. It all ended when Daniel LaRusso beat the crap out of Silver, and the police arrived to take him away, leading to peace in the valley going into Cobra Kai Season 6. Terry Silver went to prison after Cobra Kai Season 5. Cobra Kai Season 6, Part 1, has kept Silver safely behind bars. With all of Terry Silver's wealth and influence, there were a lot of questions about whether he would stay in prison in Cobra Kai Season 6. It seemed he had been too significant a force to go down so easily. However, the first part of Season 6, containing five episodes, reveals that Silver is securely behind bars. In the first episode, Cho Zen is seen looking at a newspaper, which shows Kreese's and Silver's mugshot side by side, accompanied by an article detailing their falling out and dojo drama. Moreover, the sign for Cobra Kai is thrown into a dumpster, and the dojo's doors seem to be closed for good. There were some voiced concerns throughout the first batch of Cobra Kai season 6 episodes that Silver might have found a way to exact his revenge on Daniel and Johnny. In episode 3, Sleeper, a ticking package arrived at the LaRusso home, and Johnny and Daniel both feared that it was a bomb somehow sent by Silver. However, the box was only a gender reveal device for Johnny and Carmen's baby. Little else was said about Silver in Cobra Kai Season 6, Part 1, indicating that the threat really is gone. Could Terry Silver still return? Anything is possible in Cobra Kai. Thomas Ian Griffith as Terry Silver in Cobra Kai Season 5 wearing a karate robe and standing in front of a group of his karate students in his elaborate dojo. Of course, this isn't the first time a Cobra Kai villain has been put behind bars. John Kreese was arrested in Season 4 but managed a rather outrageous breakout in Season 5. If he could do it, then it's certainly possible that Terry Silver could get out of prison as well, especially considering his wealth and power. After Part 1, there are still 10 episodes left in Cobra Kai Season 6, where pretty much anything could happen. Perhaps Silver will make one last return. However, it seems likely at this point in the game that John Kreese will be Cobra Kai's final villain.